Hi, I wasn't going to make another video with my hot point washing machine because I have quite a lot online already. But a lady asked me if it does a 90 boil wash or if it goes to 70. I looked in the book, it didn't say so. And as you can see on here as well, it doesn't really say. Let me focus that for you does not say at all. Now, I have found a 90 wash and I'm going to show you. So I'm going to thank that lady very much. Right, I will leave the door open for a minute to show you what I mean. I'll put this on, hang on. Right. Now the lady said put on program 3 which I haven't used very much of because I usually use um, fast wash 30, fast wash 60, mix wash, a few others which I've mentioned in my other video. Well I'm putting on cotton standard 60 number 3. So I've done that. Now it's on for 3 hours and 35 minutes which I don't need so I'm going to as a test because the door is open put it on the timer saver press it once it goes to 1 hour 42 <clears throat> excuse me now I was told to press the temperature so if you can just watch that I'm pressing the temperature you can see it go through the things quickly No, there's a 90. Right, do it again. There's a 90 wash. Now we're saying 2 hours 45. I wonder if I press that again, if it cuts it again. I don't know yet. It's a test today. Right, so maybe it goes to 2 hours and 45 on a 90 wash. I've not done it yet because it's just an experiment today. Right, I'm going to put the machine off. The toilet lock came on then and it hasn't done that before because I hadn't really pressed it. Right, um, put this off again. I'm just finding this out now, that's why I'm posting it. Right, let's try again. Right, it's still in the memory. Right, that's fair enough. Right, we're on a normal wash. Um, where are we? Right, if I press this, which I'm not going to just a test today, for more than five seconds, it should go to auto clean which would be for one hour and ten. That's why I made the mistake before and that's why the machine was very, very hot and steam came out of uh, the other one, which was a... Um, the steam came out of the other one, which was a faulty machine. This is the replacement. I've kept the, uh, the faulty one online so you can see the difference of the machine because the other one had a very tinny sound when it was going round with a spin. Now, I'm going to shut the machine I'm going to knock it off. Pause. I'm going to knock it off and start this again. Right. I'm going to pickle you a second, so hang on. Because I have not selected what I want. So hang on, we're on three anyway, can't do anything about this. That's the thing, when you're speaking on the phone, you're not concentrating on what you're doing. Now I think it's gone to auto clean, which I don't need. As you can see, that's gone off, so now I need to sort this out quick. Um, how are we going to do this? Um, I don't know. Hang on. 
I said, everything's trial and error at the moment. I think I will put it to pump, I think. Yeah. If I put it to pump, then it'll have to do its thing before we get into a proper wash. Hopefully that'll be okay. Right. There's no water in there, so there's nothing to really pump out. So I don't know else I can open the machine at the moment. Now we've gone back to normal now. So I'll do the, I'll do this for 16 minutes for it to do its thing. And then I'm gonna set up set it up on program three on the standard 60. And then I'm going to restart it again so it goes to a 90 wash. So I'll be back in a few minutes. Right, we're on 10 minutes. I'm not gonna be videoing this for long. I've never put this on the pump. There she was no water in it. As you can see it's on the pump. Hope this doesn't mess up my machine. There's got no uh, water to pump out, but I'm doing a test, so I and I couldn't open the machine, so this is the next best thing that I could do. It's spinning anyway, so hopefully it'll be okay. Like I said, with the book, it doesn't tell you everything, so basically you're going to try and find out all by yourself. So, once this is done, I'll leave the door open, I'll set it up on program 3 to do a 90 wash, and we'll go from there. This is an 8K drum hot point washing machine, the rest of my videos are online. And it's spinning now anyway, so hopefully it should be fine. The trouble when you're speaking on the phone, you're trying to explain everything, you do uh, make, uh, no, make mistakes. So I just hope I haven't messed my machine up. So you can see we're setting this on there. Spin and pump out my own. I've been using this machine fine, no problems on it said fast wash 60, fast wash 30, I've done the mix wash which is 15 minutes, refresh 9, um, shirts, I've done the wool, I've not done the delicates yet, I have done the cotton standard 20 but I've not done the, the cotton standard 40 or the cotton standard 60. There's no reason to use the anti stain no reason to use the anti-allergen and I don't even have many synthetics so I can't see me using that one either. Except the powder is already in there so I'll leave that there and the comfort. Everyone kept asking me about this boiling wash all the time. And uh, thank you very much. I've just got found what I have found. Them. It'd be easier that you just put a boiling wash on there with a 90 on there or a 70 on there and give you an option so you're not giving things that you can't always find. I wish they would do that and make things a little bit simpler for us, but they don't. You know, we've got all these other fancy things going on for like shoes and, well I don't have that on my machines, I've seen it in my house, I do, you know, have things for shoes and special things and whatever. I mean, put a 90 wash on there, 70 wash on there and chuck some special stuff down as well. Simple enough to do. Because if they're trying to make you use what, um, I'm you know, trying to make you use um I'm trying to make you use uh, those settings basically. 
and the highest settings. I'll just start this again in a few minutes and hopefully everything will be fine. A bit of water went in anyway, not much. I'm going to make a few mistakes to get it right to the new so we'll learn. And you can always spin it on, give me a chance to sort of move on out. because I was trying to concentrate on what I was saying and look at the machine at the same time. That's why I got myself in this pickle. Now I'm going to cut all this from the video, but I'll see the point because we all make mistakes, so I'm showing you. But as far as I'm concerned, that's what it's all about. We're not perfect, are we, when we post uh, stuff? So I'm going to show you the mistake and I'll try to rectify it as quickly as possible. And I shall do a bit of a click now and then I can start the machine up properly this time. Can't believe I've done it now. Oh well, it's gone to two now. It does that sometimes. I 
because I was going to put a wash on today anyway and I wasn't going to do any more videos but because I had a nice comment about finding a 90 wash I thought I'd have a look, I found it so I thought yeah I'll post it so I finally found it like I said with this little symbol here as well That is also to select these. I'll show you that in a minute. Then the machine usually picks its own programs. It all depends what you want. They say it was on a certain program now. It was on normal. I didn't want it on normal. I put it on intensive or delicate, depending what I fancy putting it on. So I'll let this finish. I'll show you this, and then we'll set up the wash. I haven't messed up the machine, it's done its thing anyway, because it just got no water to pump out. There we go, Desert's Cliff is finished, thankfully. I haven't messed anything up here then. Great. Brilliant. Nice one. Right. Okay. Now, I'm leaving the door open this time. Lime ready. Now, see if it'll show. No, I can't show you until the uh, washing machine is actually shut. It wouldn't won't let me do it. But basically, whatever program you pick, all depending if it lets you, you can pick, press this, and it will pick intensive, normal, or delicate. You'll have to just sort that out yourself, I'm afraid. Right. I'm going to go back to number three. Start again. Um, as the lady said, program three, cotton standard 60. Now it's just gone to three hours and 35 minutes. So on a normal wash, if I can do it now. Yes, I can. I can do it when, they, when it's open. It's fine. I can see the machine's open. I can do it. Right, just to give you an example, I was trying to show you. So say I wanted that on, say I wanted that on number three, cotton standard 60, forget the 90 a minute. Then I could either pick intensive, delicate, or normal. So I'm going to go to normal, let me show you again. Intensive, delicate, or normal, stick it on normal. Now that's what you can do for most of these washers. And I've also done it, I think, I can't remember if I've done it on the refresh and I don't think it does that. I'll test that and I'll show you. Number seven, refresh nine. Number seven, that will be for nine minutes, obviously. I don't know if I can do it on there, does it? I'm not sure. No, it doesn't, it's only for normal. As you can see, only normal. On a refresh line, it's only on for nine minutes. Right, we're going to go back to number three. Okay. Now, it's just showed that 60. But we're going to go find that 90. Okay. Temperature, holding it. Letting go, holding it again. So you can see there's other options there. So you have to press it through and then you have to let it go and then press it again. And on the next uh, bit you find the 90 and the 70. So I played in hide and seek in there with this washing machine. You should actually put it on there. Seventy. So 
dirty wash, twenty wash. And then we're off. Let's do it again. Then we find a ninety wash. Then we find a seventy wash. Three hours thirty five. It would be on, but then I would press that once. Half the time. So I'm gonna press it again. Sixty. Fifty. Forty. 30, 20 wash, and it's off. I forget about that now, I wouldn't have uh, looked for anything else. So I press it again. There's my 90 wash, 70, and then we go back. So do this one more time. So temperature, we're gonna show you one more time. It's a 60 wash, which are on cotton standard 60 now, which is number three. Or I can switch it to 50, a 40, a 30, a 20, then it's off. Then I forget about that, then just all the options that are showing on here, then it goes to off. So I'm going to forget about that now because I wouldn't know. I wouldn't have thought about pressing it anymore unless I needed to. So I'm going to press it again. It says off so I forget about it, but I go again and then I find the 90. I did not use that and the 70. So I'm going to go through the whole process again. There's a 90 wash. I'm going to do a um, dustbin. Now it's on normal. I've got options to do intensive. I don't need it. Don't need a delica because it's cottons. Normal. It's flashing for me to go. I'm on that, I'm on my 90. Machine's going on. Now, it's on for three hours. I don't want it on for three hours. Double check, temperature. It's on 90, I don't want it on for three hours. Press it once, hopefully it works this time. Right, well it's gone to 245. Right, if I had it on the temperature 90, which is on, it would have been on for oh, three hours. But I've only pressed the timer saver and it's on for two hours 45. Now I don't need my things to be washing for that amount of time. But we're going to do it today. I am not going to take all of this because you can see it's just a washing machine. You know what it does. You've seen, I've posted online, um, it's spinning, the cotton cycles, I've gone through everything. So that's what I'm going to do today, is put it on and do it for 2 hours and 45 minutes. That's why I'm always happy to use these washers and maybe the cotton standard 60, which is still just as good for the towels, the bedding and my cat stuff. And if it was on a 60 wash which I think is fine anyway, because that's pretty hot enough. Obviously it's not hot, hot enough for some people, because whether they like the 90 or the 70, I get that. But I'm happy with it. Then uh, I would have pressed then my timer saver, and I would have taken me down to one hour and something like it did before. But today we're doing it for this amount of time. So as you see, 90 wash. We've got it, we do find it on the temperature, and we've got that spin, so, and it's on normal, so, knocking on. I think it takes a lot of electric and a lot of time, and if the clothes aren't that really, really dirty, I don't see the point of using or having a washing machine over 2 hours and 45 minutes, unless it's really needed. So at least you've got the option there, and I'm glad I found it, thanks to that lady. Whoever you are, thank you. I will be using this one now and again, when I have, when I really need to wash things, I really need a good body wash. But I just got normal stuff in there today, like dressing gown, towels, bits and pieces. So they're not going to, they're going to be alright, they're going to be fine on the body wash, and they'll be alright. That's fine. Well, I don't need to post the whole machine. 
that the most important thing I wanted to say, I found it and see if this is helpful to anybody else. So this is a hot point washing machine. And you can see it's a hot point washing machine. I put the light on because it's a bit dark in here. It? it says it's got dressing gown in there, towels. So it'll be fine on empty wash. They're not really dressed, they just need fresh enough. They would have been fine in the past wash uh, 60 today. And there would have been like an hour and something time to go on. But I wanted to try the 90 because everyone's been keeping on about it. And there's the 90 wash. It's pretty half hour. And that spin, I can change the spins still. So we'll go to that one. It's on normal. I've tried my best to explain the best I can. So hopefully it's helpful. Um, I don't know what else I can say basically. Because it basically we've covered everything on this machine and it's basically all mine. Like I said, I didn't, didn't hold it on for that long but you know, if it's a 90 wash, it's going to be that amount of time. It's fair enough. As you can see earlier on, I messed it up because I was trying to experiment. And it was going fine, then I shut the door and all went into a like, pickle. So I found I put the pump on and it did its thing. Not much water in there, but the machine was okay and we were able to start the cycle off properly. So, there we go. So I know now that I have to, I'm not doing it now, that's the 90 wash there, but I know if I press that a few times, I will actually go through the 20 wash, the 40 wash, the 60, it will show up a 50 that doesn't show up here, it doesn't show a 50 here, but it does show a 50 on, on, on the uh, temperature. It shows the 70 and it shows the 90. So it, when it when you go through the through this, as I said, you keep pressing it through from the 20, the 30, the 40. If there was a 50, it doesn't show on the board here, but there is a 50 there, and it goes like to off. And then you forget about it, as I say, you press it again, you find the 90. So it's basically hidden in the cheek actually. You know, look at all these tidy washes. They could put like in that, it could make this room to put a 90 wash here and a 70 wash and put like a boil wash. They've got everything else going on. Because it's hide and seek with the machine, it doesn't show in the book, it doesn't show here. So I would have had this machine and never used it because I wouldn't have known. I might have found it eventually because you just see always messing with machines and trying to have a lock. But I haven't posted this online, I didn't have the comments that I've received. I've had some fantastic comments, thank you. I wouldn't have found it. So, there we go. It's on 2 hours and 41 minutes. I like that, I found the 90. Please with that, thank you. Right, and we're done. So, it's just going to do its thing now. And if you want to check out my other videos, doing the 1400 spin doing other washes, you know, did online. If you want me to do anything else, well, there's not much as I can do, but I will have a go and uh, go from there. I mean, somebody wanted me to start the machine off, putting the powder in, I've done all that. Gone through most of the cycles, tried to explain. I mean, I've already had this, this machine for a month, I think, so. As I said, it's all trial and error. And if you don't do these things, you don't know. Right, we're on two hours and forty now, so. You should let me know how it all pans out. Once it's all finished. 
I will uh, leave a comment on this video and to say uh, what it was like. So, um, thanks for bearing with me with this video as it's uh, a bit of a test again today. So, um, as I said, happy weekend all and thanks for viewing my other videos and thanks again also if you view this and thank you very much to that lady I'm over the moon I keep pressing that now Mindy wash thank you <laughs> ok bye hi thanks for viewing my videos it's much appreciated if you'd like to leave any comments please make sure you post them below and I will get back to you thank you very much bye